Hey guys, Unfrequented World Photography coming at you from Chisholm and we are out here today because of the fantastic clay, uh, really heavy soil uh, that we have here. I've bought a new shovel and today the plan is to do a review of that product. So the last shovel that I bought, which was tempered, didn't even last two digs. So totally disappointed. We have a new product and I'll show you guys that right so now. So here's the old shovel guys, which was actually a new shovel. And uh, you can see right there, it cracked after about, I don't know, two days of use. So completely useless, waste of 20 bucks. So here is the new shovel that we've bought, guys. It's the Little Digger. It's about 29 inches long uh, with an 8 inch blade on it. Very sturdy, very heavy duty. Uh, feels that way anyway. It's quite a bit heavier than those other shovels we had. And uh, we'll take a closer look. Well, I'm not sure about that, but uh, anyway. <laughs> the uh, grip on this actually feels like it's got a little bit of uh, molding to it, like uh, it's not hard plastic. So it actually feels very comfortable in the hand, very very nice. Okay, so if we look here at this end, we see that this nice fold comes all the way to the end of the blade. So where the other ones had a weak spot right at the bottom, there's no room for that here because it travels the full length of the blade. A uh, nice serrated edge on each side for cutting and feels very thick and sturdy. We can see that in here, the handle is in fact wood, but it is like fiberglass coated. So it feels very sturdy, very good in the hand. So enough about how it looks and feels. Let's give it a try. Well, I can say that there is no flex in this thing at all. It's nice and narrow, so you get a much more controlled hole. Uh, your plug should be a little cleaner then, and uh, I don't feel any flex. Let's try some more digging. The little digger can be found on Facebook, or you can find it on eBay. I purchased it on eBay, and for Canadians, it was $54.99 plus shipping plus duty, so $15 shipping, and $15 in duty, which is essentially just your tax. Um, for the price, this is a, a big item, and for $15, it's very well packaged. Uh, he had bubble wrap around both ends and a cardboard sleeve around this end, comes in a box. Um, for 15 bucks, guys, you can't beat that. If you're American, $39, hey, you even have a better price than we do. It feels very sturdy. Let's get out and try it. Um, I can't recommend it till we try it, but I think I know where I'm going with this, or I wouldn't have bought one. <laughs> okay guys, I'm gonna turn over a big plug here just to see. Cuts very nicely, and as I'm pulling, there's no flex. I don't feel any flex at all. You can get a very controlled dig with this. And as you can see, it's that real thick, heavy clay out in this field here. And I don't feel any flex in here at all. Very sharp, very controlled. I like it. I don't know if I should bother digging any more holes just to show you guys. Okay, let's go deep, guys. All the way. There's absolutely no flex to that. Very sturdy. Well, there's a testament to the new digger, guys. Little digger. I actually caught the edge of this by accident when I was uh, trying to lift the plug out and boop, quite a bit of force. Uh, it caught me by surprise and I just kind of stumbled into it and I pried that right out of there. I don't recommend doing prying with your new tools, but uh, other than a scratch on the front here, eh, it came right out. So, so far it's looking good for the little digger. Well guys, after 15 minutes of uh, digging with the little digger, I gotta give it a thumbs up. Uh, for the price, it seems like it's gonna be a very capable unit, and I'm gonna give it a recommendation. We'll come back and look at this again after 10 or 15 hunts, and I'll show you guys how it's holding up. But for now, and the price, 
it seems like it's a great item.